the toss. The Gators won it and deferred, so they will kick off and challenge their defense to try to establish a tone early on. And I think that's a good thing. You, you've got to get this defense playing uh, football where they're playing at a high pace. You've got the 90,000 screaming fans that's going to be here to help support them. So let's see if they can go down and get some three and outs. Uh, early in the year, a lot of the three and outs, getting the offense, the ball in good field position, not so in the last four ball games. DJ Moore, the Vanderbilt return guy, he's their best. Florida will kick away from him. And aim it instead for Alex Washington. Washington breaks to the outside. Across the 40 and gives Vanderbilt excellent field position at the 44-yard line. Brian Thomas, a reserve pouncey, starting on nose after just a handful of practices for the Gators. And there's not a lot of running room in the middle. Adams bounces off a hit and falls forward across midfield. And it'll bring up third down. is thrown and caught at the 45 and a third down conversion for Vanderbilt. Sean Walker makes the catch. Garrison number 22 back in at the running back for Vandy. Adams with time, fires incomplete off the fingertips of Earl Bennett. And this is a great play by linebacker AJ. 29 yard line. Now Tebow fires the other way. And he finds Lewis Murphy and picks up about nine more as we put the ball on the 39, empty backfield. Wide open, Caldwell. Bubba Caldwell into Vanderbilt territory inside the 42-yard line. Turns it upfield. Great yardage on uh, a first down pass. Vanderbilt with a three-man front. Florida fakes the handoff. Going deep down the sideline for Murphy. And he's got it. First and goal at the three-yard line. And this is just an outstanding effort. By the, the quarterback's been on the center. Now they go back into the shotgun. And even that would have scored on that one. Number 13 for Tim Tebow. Well, that, that's what you... And unless there's a review, Ehas will go for the extra point. That's 41 in a row for Joey Ehas. Tim Tebow... He's talking with Greg Madison. He says the experience as a center certainly helps the transition. Well, Vandy gashes the Gators up front. Big hole and a lot of running room. And pick up a... with time goes down the sideline and it's incomplete trying to get it to Sean Walker but Juan D. Pierre Louis was right they don't need a lot on fourth down Florida has to be careful not to jump another rugby style kick hits at the 15 Brandon James fields it at the 7 James to the 20 he's got room Brandon James down the sideline tripped up in Vanderbilt territory inside the 40 step now fires and a sliding attempt made and it looks like they'll give him the catch Percy Harvin inside the 20 great oh extremely sharp throwing the ball early on there's Harvin Percy to the 10 Percy Harvin scores wow. Larry early in the ball game I said yeah, when you give Percy the ball. Such a dynamic talent. Averages almost 12 yards a touch for his career. And Harvin has helped give the Florida game. Crowd making noise here at the Swamp. Swing pass incomplete for Jackson Garrison. Third down and five for the Gators. Tebow with time, completes it. First down and more for Harvin across midfield. Harvin. Percy inside the 40. Percy Harvin race to the corner. Harvin driven out of bounds near the 10 yard line. Now they're looking for their third score. Bad snap. 
Tebow picks it up and is knocked to the ground, and that'll be a loss of 25 yards or so. It's third and 33, but 10 or so puts you in pretty good field goal range. There's a throw and a catch to Bubba Caldwell at the 21, and that'll make it left nine. His last was his longest of the year, a 43 against Georgia, but not this time. So the Gators lose a third and long for Vanderbilt. Gators show a blitz. Now they drop cover. It's a screen pass. And it's going to work for a first down as Hawkins takes it across the 30 to the 34 where he's right. Third down. Fired to Bennett. Earl Bennett's got the ball into Florida territory. Joe Hayden makes the stop and uh, hit him with the penalty. Vanderbilt at the Florida 37. Commodore is looking deep. They throw deep over the middle. Man is open. And Vanderbilt has a first and goal inside the five. The tight end, Jake Bradford. Mackenzie Adams, he's in the end zone for a touchdown. So Vanderbilt drives the length of the field after the missed field goal by Florida. And they get back within a score. You know, he heard to play 60 minutes. Extra point is good. And with it, you do a lot of things right. And sure enough, it's second and one. Gators go inside. Big running here. Houston Moore inside the 30. Moore drag out of bounds at the 22-yard line. Great blocking. Over. Moore with four carries for 37 yards. Tebow has only carried it once. Flips it out wide open. Faison. This reminds me of the Gator football team that we saw early in the year. That time they saw early in the year, just everybody going 120 miles an hour on each and every play to help each other be successful. Harvey with the big rush, tipped and intercepted by Jermaine Cunningham. Cunningham inside the 20, the Gators will have the ball at the 17 yard line. Jermaine Cunningham being alert, couldn't get there to, to uh, flush the quarterback, get the sack quarterback. From the 17, Tebow fires, caught at the five. It's a first and goal Gators, Percy Harvin. Tebow under pressure, fires, touchdown Bubba Caldwell. And this is the explosive Gator offense we saw the first. As I said, it looked like confusion, but it wasn't. It was Wandy calling the play out, and the Gator defense stopped it. Now a throw out in safety route, but way shy of a first down. They complete it to George Smith. Let's see if we can get the, the, big, uh, the big guy going through the mill. Gators fire. And there's Harvin. Harvin to the 45. Ready to snap the football as soon as the uh, referee blows it available for, uh, for play. There's Harvin with another first down inside the Vandy 40. Fifths or tries to cover. They have not covered the Gators well. Here comes the pressure. There goes the ball to Caldwell, and the Gators have a first down at the 25. Excellent job on picking up the... 1-11 to go and a timeout remaining for Florida. Tebow fires Caldwell again and Bubba's down at the 13. Well, I can tell you. Bandy with a lot of guys up around the line of scrimmage. And they're coming. Tebow fires for Caldwell. Touchdown! It's like playing darts. Tebow is so accurate today. That time he moved to his left just to buy himself a little additional time. And uh, Bubba Caldwell on a post pattern. Ball is thrown. It is allowing teams 327 yards per game in total offense. Third and long for Vanderbilt. Adams with plenty of time. Fires. It's caught. Spinning ahead for a first down. And inside the 15 is.
is Sean Walker. The Gators had him stopped short and missed the tackle. The third quarter. Here's the blitz. Adams throws it for the corner. It is deflected and incomplete. Joe Hayden got a fall on it to deny the touchdown. Now, what a hit for 14. Not a very good snap, but well handled. And the kick is good. Give an assist. It's here at the University of Florida. From the 38, Har Harvin comes in motion toward Tebow. They fake to Harvin. Tebow rolling, fires. Uh-oh. Intercepted. The safety, Langford has it at the 42-yard line. Deflected pass, starts to make some noise here at the Swamp. Adams walk, runs out of pressure, pumps once, gets a defender up, and he'll get down to about the 40, 39-yard line, and well short of a first down. On the year, two out of three are good with time it's deflected it's incomplete and the Gator defense this time there's a flag on the no, they, five receivers out Vanderbilt blitzes Florida picks it up there's Harvin he's short of a first down at the 45 however 42 yard line each each time Henry kicks a high floater Fair catch signaled four. He's run into by a teammate. It's Florida football at the 17-yard line. How about that? Well, if, if you're a Vandy. This quarter, now let's see what Florida can do with it. From the 17, Tebow keeps. Tebow runs into a man at the five, fights his way forward just shy of the goal line. They wouldn't give it to him. 16 yards, first and goal. Now, guys, second and goal. He'll keep it. He's in this time. Touchdown, Tim Tebow, his second running score of the day. And how about that? A record in the history of the Southeastern Conference. That uh, power left formation. And uh, they're eight offensive possessions one punt one missed field goal will delay route to Bennett Bennett makes the catch and gains about seven or eight yards and that might be his longest gain of the season the Gators are second and about three. Oh, they let him have the corner mistake on the corner for the Gators and Hawkins takes it down inside the 20 yard line the forward handoff. They throw in the direction of the blitz, another missed tackle, and Walker's out of bounds. They, they don't mark him out. He stepped out around the 11, I thought, but since been in and out of the lineup all year long with a sprained knee. On third down, completed pass short of the first down. Earl Bennett makes his sixth catch of the day, but he doesn't have, no, I'm sorry, not Bennett, that's George Smith making that. Keep it, he ball came out. Florida's got the ball, look out. Headed the other way. Dustin Doe, Dustin Doe, they won't catch him. 99 yards. It all, it all might be for naught because the official at the other end is signaling touchdown. The ruling on the field is that the ball broke the plane of the goal line. Before the fumble, it was a touchdown. Now the previous play was able to knock the ball out early on. They're going to go for two, and they're not going to get it. It's intercepted. Spikes picked it off, ran into the official, and then was tackled. So technically, that's not an interception. It's just a no end up at an angle, then decided against it and teed the ball straight up. Got the Gators to crawl up, but gets deep to Brandon James at the one. James has a little bit of a hole and runs right through it. Brandon James up near midfield, tripped up and down at the Vanderbilt 46 yard line. Brian Honfeld. Tebow fake to Moore, pumps once, he'll run for it. He's got five, he's got 10, he's got 15, goes out of bounds with 20. See Tebow running with the football only when he has to. 
Blitz comes, they get it out. Caldwell with the catch inside the 20 to about the 18 yard line as a receiver. Yeah, give him a few more. Harvin keeps his balance, he will score. What a day for Percy Harvin, what a day for the Gator offense. And I tell you, the thing about Percy Harvin is whenever he splits it, he really... Harvin and Tebow have each run for two touchdowns. Caldwell, two touchdown passes. Jared Faison has caught a touchdown pass, and Joey East, you would think he's a better weapon than that and find another way to get him involved. They throw it deep, and it's broken up and caught by Wandy Pierre-Louis. Louis reverses field, which is where all the Commodores are, and he'll be chased out of bounds at the 42-yard line. I guess he just wanted to meet some people. He had all his blockers. And the freshman from Georgia, just outside Atlanta, is going to get a chance to play a little quarterback for the Gators. Looks one way, throws the other for Murphy. Lewis Murphy across midfield. Gets about seven or Cam Newton, a star performer up in Georgia as a high schooler. Very highly recruited. Gained four yards. The Gators run it up inside. Keiston Moore. Don't want to do that. Bad snap. Newton tried to pick it up and run with it. Not a good idea. Vanderbilt plays double dribble with it. And it'll be a touchdown for the Commodores as running it in is Darlon Speed. A reserve defensive back gets the touchdown for Vandy. Well, Adams sat from behind, and the Gators pick it up. Torrey Davis making the play. 76. Newton keeps. Newton to the 40, runs over a man to the 45-yard line. Brent Trice, the backup seven to get in because the SEC has so many teams in range. Nice run. Moore takes it outside to the 34, shy of a first down. The bridge. There's Moore again. Keiston Moore down to the 20. Picks up another Florida Gator first down. If he's not first team all SEC, somebody needs to take away the votes from those who vote because he is dynamic. Keiston Moore inside the 10. Moore, smelling the end zone, makes it a first and goal at the seven yard line, and that will probably improve to 17 and one here in the swamp. And 28 and seven overall.